Broski, season number two has arrived. And oh boy, there is a lot of big news. Some of y'all might not like it. Karim Benzema has requested a transfer. He feels like he needs a new challenge. He is no longer motivated at Real Madrid. Can you blame him though? He has won the Champions League six times. Cristiano Ronaldo is unhappy at Real Madrid. He feels unappreciated by the fans, the club and the coach. Tony Kroos. Many times this season, Tony Kroos was replaced by Chouameni and Kamavinga. Tony Kroos feels like he is way better than both players. Tony Kroos wants out. The Brazilian winger Anthony thinks he made a mistake by joining Real Madrid. Carlo Ancelotti went for Rodrigo and not Anthony. Anthony demands a starting role, but he is not getting that at Real Madrid. Isco is joining Manchester United at the beginning of next season. Luka Jovic is not part of the plan of Real Madrid. Lucas Vasquez got outplayed by Carvajal. He feels like he can still be an important player for a different team. Marcelo, his contract is expensive expiring in two months. Real Madrid will not give him a new contract. Antonio Blanco will get a second opportunity from the new coach. Marvin, his contract is expiring and Real Madrid will let him go. Sergio Arribas is leaving. Luis Lopez is leaving. And also Nakai is leaving. The players that are on loan and will return are Odria Zola, Brahim, Kubo, but Kubo will be sold. Majoral, Just, but just will be sold. Rainier, Miguel, Altuba, but Altuba will be sold. Tobias, but Tobias will be sold. And Guerrero, but also Guerrero will be sold. After many years of being a manager, Carlo Ancelotti has decided to retire. And in search of a new manager for Real Madrid, we found a club legend. The new manager of Real Madrid is Sergio Ramos. So Real Madrid is the champion of Europe and Spain. And look at this though, this is insane. Benzema is the top scorer of La Liga. But look at this, Benzema is the king of the assist. Benzema is the best player of Spain. And next season, Benzema is gone. Just like Toni Kroos in second place. The next season is going to be difficult. So we gotta improve the squad. Look, listen, Benzema will leave, so we need a new striker. Toni Kroos will leave, but we got Chouameni. And we got Kamavinga. And we got Alaba and Carvajal. But I think we got to strengthen the left back and the right back position. So in the next transfer window, we got a lot of things to do. Let's have a look at the objectives. Youth development within two seasons. So not necessary right now. Brand exposure. We completed both. Nice. Financial within three seasons. Domestic success. Win the league title. Done. And last but not least, win the Champions League. And we all know what happened. Newcastle United? wants Tony Kroos. They offered 73.7, but I feel like Tony Kroos at Newcastle United is not it. Tony Kroos needs to be in the Champions League, my guys. Season number two has officially begun. The most important thing for now is the transfer budget. Um, 140, that's, oh, wait, wait, wait. We got a lot more, my guys. What about this? 209. Wow! We gotta be smart though. The objectives, hold on. Youth development, I do not like youth plays, my guys. Brand exposure, sign one of the best players in the world. 82 plus. Mm, no problem. Get 12 clean sheets in the league. We got Courtois. Financial within three seasons. Domestic success. Win the league title again, win the cup. Copa de España. We gotta win the Copa de España in season number two. And of course, continental success win the Champions League. Okay, first things first. We gotta buy a replacement for Benzema. We gotta bring this player back to Europe, my guys. He already played for Inter, but that didn't go well. And there you go, Sergio Ramos, ladies and gentlemen. He is a Brazilian striker. Gabriel Barbosa. This is going to be insane. This is going to be insane. Hold on. 35 for Barbosa. Please don't get mad. The replacement of Benzema. They want you, I mean, don't do that. What about 40? 40 mil. What about 40? 64 for count bro hold on by the way i am recording in 4k so the quality is going to be a lot better from now on my guys 50 50 50 come on sergio ramos 50 64 okay let's try i need a 5 mil discount 59 for barbosa barbosa is going to replace um, benzema we got a deal 
we got a deal so let's set up the contract gabriel barbosa back in europe you love to see it squad row is going to be 82 overall we still got benzema what about rotation is that good enough for you my guy that's good okay next up um four years right for gabriel barbosa look at this haircut beautiful okay next up release clause we gotta hold on i think in la liga we gotta include the release clause right what about 75 mil release clause i do not know what i'm doing my guy please don't get mad please 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 oh they accept they accept nice okay next up financial this is going to be a big upgrade for barbosa he's making 56 at the moment what about 250k and a signing bonus of one mil do we got a deal so we got Gabriel Barbosa, the first signing of season number two and the first signing of Sergio Ramos. Okay, we are not done yet. We got Benzema, who is leaving, Tony Kroos. Um, and we need to replace, I mean, we need to strengthen the left back and the right back position. I know the perfect player. This player is also from Spain. He is playing in Germany at the moment. Angelino. Let's go. This second season is going to be epic 46 for angelino 46 for angelino they want anthony wait but anthony but to leipzig though that is not the place my guy no but maybe but maybe i mean like they got um by München, they got dortmund but i feel like leipzig is equal to um dortmund so they will play in the champions league every season Anthony to Leipzig. Anthony to Leipzig. Counter. Can you drop the price just a little bit? 25. And Anthony for Angelino. Do we got a deal? Do we got a deal? We got a... Wow. Wow. Anthony is going to Leipzig and we got Angelino. Okay, let's negotiate with Angelino. Um, important role. Left back. We got Alaba. But Alaba is a 85. So I understand. He's making 94 at the moment contract length four years for angelino he's also 25 just like gabriel barbosa right what about 85 mil for angelino let me know if you think this is a good amount they accept okay next up how much did i give barbosa i forgot 200 or 250 250 and then one mil signing bonus i don't know do we got a deal he's making only 94 so yeah he will accept but I gotta check something out. Welcome to the team. Barbosa is making 250. Angelino is making 250. Ah, a little mistake. Okay, now we gotta strengthen the right back position. This player is playing at FC Porto, the Portuguese right back. João Mario. Let's offer 15 below the current value. Sergio Ramos, make it happen, my guy. Come on, why? No! 16 mil for João Mario. 22.4. Whoa, that is a lot. I would like to stay below 20. So, 19 and a half for João Mario from FC Porto. The Portuguese right back. Do we got a We got a deal. We got a deal. We got a deal. Um, Sporadic? Okay, he accepts. Three years only? Counter. Four years, my guy. I think that is better. He accepts. Okay um proposed release clause this is again very difficult what about 40 mil for jean mario 40 mil that is double the amount right they accept so last but not least the wage i think 70k and then 500k signing bonus for jean mario what do you think about this my guy jean mario accepts welcome to real madrid this is a very controversial signing my guys don't get mad nico gonzalez like i said don't get mad Javi is blowing up at barcelona but gonzalez not so much he is unhappy at barcelona 70 mil for nico gonzalez this is going to be the most controversial signing um, of the series Shama, don't do that. Don't do that. 18 mil for Nico Gonzalez, the player from FC Barcelona. 19.5. Let's make it 19. Zafi, do we got a deal? We got a deal. We got a deal. Nico Gonzalez is going to join Real Madrid. I wonder how much money is um, Gonzalez making at FC Barcelona? 75k. Okay. Sporadic role. We accept. Four years. 
release clause. Hold on, hold on. 100 mil for um, Nico Gonzalez. Is it too much? Is it too much? 48. Why so low? Wait, let's make it 50. Release clause of 50 mil? I like that better. Okay, we got a deal. Next up. 60k. He is going to make less at Real Madrid. That doesn't make sense. You gotta fire your agent, my guy. But we accept though. <laughs> Nico Gonzalez is now a player of Real Madrid. So we got Vinicius on the left wing, but we don't got a backup for Vinicius. We need a backup left winger fast. This player is from Spain. Jeremy Pino. 31 mil for Jeremy. They want Rudiger. Rudiger, Rudiger, Rudiger. Never going to happen. 32 for Pino. 41.5. Hold on. Below 40, please. 39 and a half for Jeremy Pino. Next signing of Sergio Ramos. No, not going to happen. Why not? Like I said, below 40. 39.9. We got a deal. We are making a lot of signings, but a lot of players will leave. So yeah, he's making 90K only. Wow. Sporadic role at Real Madrid. He accepts. Interesting. Release clause of 92.2. Wow. Nico Gonzalez only got 50. Pino got 92. Almost 100. Wow. Okay. Accept. We got to accept. This is how La Liga does business. Um, The wage. Oh man. What about 76? Signing bonus of 1 million. Pino is going to be a important player, my guys, in the future. Submit the offer. Jeremy Pino. We got him. He accepts. Okay, so listen up. This was meant to be. We need a backup striker. We only got 31.3. Hold on, hold on. We only got around 34 mil. The player that I want to buy cost around 31. So like I said, this was meant to be the last signing of Zed Ramos. We need a backup striker. And we are talking with Pep Guardiola. Julian Alvarez. Oh, he cost 34. We don't got that money. Maybe we gotta um, include a player. I got an idea. Hold on. Player swap, striker, Luka Jovic. And then change the fee to 20 mil. 25. 25 mil. This could be it though. This could be it. 36. That is way too much. Counter. Pep. 28. Come on. Pep. Come on. 6.3 left. Come on. We got a deal. This is the last signing of the... Wow. We don't got any money left. Okay, let's negotiate with Julian Alvarez, the last signing of this season for now. I think rotation, let's start with sporadic because you never know. Gabriel Barbosa might be, you know, the one. He accepts. Okay, four years, we got a deal. Release clause though, 103.5, accept. Wow, that is a lot. The wage, the wage, the wage. He is going to make a little bit more money. What about 160K signing bonus, one mil? That's it. The last signing. We are done. We are done. We can finally start the season. Look at this. We already completed one. Sign at least two players younger than 20. We completed that also. Isco has joined Manchester United. We got an offer for Chuameni from Manchester City. Never going to happen. Transfer budget, we already know. I don't care about the friendly tournament. Let's simulate the friendly tournament. Um, do we got offers? Vasquez, Benzema. Leipzig again? Le How do they got so much money? Anthony already went there, right? Yeah. Leipzig could become the new Bayern München. Benzema is maybe the best striker in the world. Leipzig is not it. Vasquez though. Um, let's see. They offer 16.9. We can get 21.4. Let's delegate. Let's simulate some more. We lost against Ajax. My first and only love Ajax. Bruh. First quest. Hold on. 18.9. You know what? To Sevilla? Except. I think London can still be of great use, so he's not leaving. First quest transfer talks ended. Of course, FIFA. To Tony Kroos. Barcelona. No way. No way. No, no way. So I bought Nico Gonzalez from uh, Barcelona. And I bought him because Tony Kroos is leaving. Hold on though. Antoine Griezmann. I don't need Antoine Griezmann, but maybe we can negotiate. This is going to be very difficult. But what about 80 mil for Kroos? Way below his value, my guys. Come on. Way below his value. But he is um, around 34 years old. So I think this is a good price. Wow, Tony Kroos to Barcelona. Wait. We got the final. Last show against um, Real Madrid. Super Cup. Tony Kroos is gone, my guys. Tony Kroos is 
gone. Season number two is going to be epic. Um, Manchester United won fast quest. You know what? Let's accept. Because the last time we accepted, the transfer talks ended. So is fast quest joining Manchester? I don't know. Wait, wait. Atletico, I, oh, I, I, I don't know. No. Oh. My guess is Benzema rejected the offer himself. Fast quest sold. Carvajal, never. So we got the Super Cup. The first game of season number two is finally here. Thank you for your patience. We'll start taking questions now. That's all we have time for now. Thank you. The Super Cup is here, the game against Lazio. So I guess um, Lazio won uh, the Europa League, right? Yeah, Lazio against Real Madrid, Italy against Spain, beautiful. Yo, what is going on with the kids from Lazio? What the... I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Let's go. Luis Alberto again. Great pass. Carvajal is still playing in the starting 11. We got the ball. Good defense. And like I said, look. Clearly, he is still a great right back. Rudiger is back from his injury. This is going to be a great season. Gabriel Barbosa. Lost the ball. He lost the ball, Barbosa lost the ball, Carvajal. Gabriel, Barbosa! Stracosha with the save. First attempt for Barbosa. There goes Sergio Ramos, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, there goes Carvajal. Why did sliding tackle? Come on, don't be hateful. So, uh, Militao is on the bench. We got a pretty decent bench now. Good defense, but unlucky. Alberto. Immobile! Courtois with an amazing save. Oh my. Replay, look. Immobile, great striker, but Courtois, the best goalkeeper in the world. In the world. Chouameni, right there. Van Verde. Um, I tried to pass the ball to uh, Chouameni. Bad pass. Oh my god. Okay, we got really good, so no problem. Carvajal. Hey, that's a. Oh my, that's dirty. Yellow card. Ref. Ref. Come on, ref. The first half is over. We didn't create a lot of opportunities, though. Only three. Lazio won. 53% possession, but a pretty difficult first half. Maybe we need somebody else. Here we go. Chouameni. Faverda. Finishes Junior. Golasso, 1 0 up. Offside? No, no, it is not. It is not offside. 1 0 up against Lazio in the second half. Woo! I thought it was offside, my guy. Right here, the, the pass from um, Faferda to Finicius. 1 0 up against Lazio. Again, the goal from Fini. But let's make maybe 
one substitution i haven't seen much from barboza to be honest so let's give alvarez a try we made some pretty amazing transfers my guys there you go alvarez for barboza one nil up against lazio there goes anderson keep it together how casimiro with the foul like rudiger no no Ooh. Anderson is the best player for Lazio in this game. You know what? Casimiro is having a bad day. Uh, what about... Yeah, what about this? Hold on. What about this? Gonzalez will make his debut for Real Madrid. And again, I gotta make some screenshots because look. Something beautiful right here. There goes Nico Gonzalez. Advantage. And the yellow card for... Who's that? Escalante. Why Escalante? Why? Right here. The foul. That's a du... Nico... Okay. Here we go again with <laughs> Vinny Jr. No! The wrong pass! Wait! Wait! No! Shot block! Finish, finishes, finishes. Man of the match. Man of the match. Vinicius is the man of the match. 2 0. And I think it is safe to say we are going to win the Super Cup. We are going to win the Super Cup. Oh, the scissor. Oh, no, no. Whoa, Courtois. Rudiger, Rudiger, Rudiger. Rudiger, Rudiger, Rudiger. That is the. The goal for Lazio, 2-1. Now it is going to be very exciting until the end. Because now it is dangerous again. Offside. It's over! We have just won the Super Cup. The first trophy of season number two is already in. It's already in and Vinicius Jr. is going to be the man of the match. First trophy of season number two. Who is the captain by the way? Because Benzema was the captain last year. Oh my. Who is the captain? Who is the captain? Who? Carvajal. Of course Carvajal. Who else? Who else? There you go. The trophy for Real Madrid. What a first episode of season number two. But this is also going to be the end of the episode. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And turn on that notification bell. I'm out, ski.